What's up guys and welcome to New Tarot. I am an energy and intuitive reader and I'm here to do the love message for somebody. So let's see who's going to get this reading. I do have my Instagram and Snapchat in the description box if you guys want. Cancer, what's up Cancies? Thank you so much for being here. This message could resonate with you if you have Cancer as a Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. The energy might be reversed for you, Cancies. Actually, it's not because it's a love reading. Sorry, I'm just used to saying that. <laughs> um, so this is a love reading, Cancer. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to see how you're feeling about your person on this side, how your person is feeling about you on this side, and the energies in the middle. Um, if I have to ask for some advice, I will. Also, I am very blunt in my love readings. I love love, and I will let you know if you shouldn't be with somebody or whatever I'm feeling very honestly here because if you're dealing with someone who's not supposed to be the person for you, I will let you know so that, guess what? You can go to the person that you're supposed to be. That means that person is still waiting. So, um, yeah, I don't sugarcoat nothing, and I am very blunt when it comes to my love readings. Just wanted to let that out there. All right, Cancer. How is Cancer feeling, Spirit, about their person? <laughs> I said that really fast. You have love yourself first. <sighs> Free yourself. It's time to take control of your life. This person, you feel neglected by this person. I automatically felt that would love yourself first. You feel neglected. Um, I also feel like you've been around this. You've been around this damn circle more than one time. You came to this realization that this person neglects you. This is not the first time. All right. Hold on a second, Cancer. Okay. That's what I get. That's fine. All right. How does Cancer feel about their person? How does Cancer feel about their person? Bottom of the deck is the Temperance. Could be a Sagittarius. Doesn't have to be. You have the Emperor with the Eight of Swords here. The Four of Pentacles in reverse with the King of Wands. Okay, so I feel like you don't know what to do. You're all up in your head with this person. I feel like you feel like this could be an Aries. I feel like you feel like this person is very um, dominating. Like this person likes to take charge. I'd like to take lead. But it's like, the, where, where are your decisions? It's like they're stomping all over what you want to do. It's like they do what the freak they want. And you're just sitting there like, okay. I feel like you're very attracted to this person. I feel like you want to let this person go. I feel like you want to let them go because you want mental clarity. It's like you want to stop doubting yourself. I feel like this energy makes you doubt yourself. Like if you can't make your decisions for yourself or the choices that you make here. Oh, yeah, I, I see a separation or a breakup coming if it hasn't already here. Um, I feel like you're kind of undecisive. I feel like before this happens, you're not going to just like do it. I feel like you're going to decide on it for a while. Maybe stop talking to this person or talk very little. Um, if you are trying to offer something new to this person, it's not going to work out. Judgment needs to be made on the situation and it's going to be made if it hasn't been made already. Hmm. Interesting, Cancies. All right. So let's see how your person is feeling about you. How is Cancer's person feeling about you? About Cancer. <laughs> how is Cancer's person feeling you have make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps to guide it to take. This person is so sweet. Flirt, extend your. Well, that's what they're showing me. This person is like, like. I feel like they want to make an effort, or they're trying to make an effort. You let scared me. They're why is everything falling? This might be falling apart. Sorry. Um, they're trying to make an effort here. They really are. Like, they really are. And I feel like you see that. I, if the roles are reversed, take it how it resonates, okay? Sometimes you might resonate with this side and this side. Take it how it resonates. All right, how does Cancer's person feel? Could be a Pisces. Bottom of the deck is the Ten of Wands in reverse. You have, oh, no, it's upright. You have the High Priestess with the Five of Cups. And the Seven of Pentacles with the Page of Pentacles. 
Cancer, y'all are not on the same page. <laughs> you're not on the same page with this person. This could be a Taurus, too. Um, or a Scorpio. So, your person wants to give you something here. They They regret something that they did. They regret something that they did. And I feel like their intuition is telling them to offer you something here. I don't know what it is. Maybe some time, some commitment, something. Um, they've been feeling guilty for a very long time now. This person feels like this is too burdensome here. Um, they feel like you're lazy or that it's just a lazy situation. They feel like you're very needy. They feel like um, you got a lot of legal issues or problems around you. They also feel like you could be really moody or cold. They also feel like you know, it's like they, they feel like they see you with like luxury, abundance. Like you, you're a very independent person. They see you as very self-sufficient. Okay, so let's see what the energy between both of you guys is. This person, I don't know, Cancer, you're over here giving me different energy than they are. Completely different pages. And I just feel like it's, you guys are looking at this relationship from a different perspective. It's like someone's looking at it through love. The other one is looking at it through um, a different lens. I don't know. Maybe a teamwork more than a love thing. Okay. Um, what is the energy between these two, Cancer? Spirit knows what I meant to say. You have the Hermit. Gosh. We have the Star with the Four of Cups in reverse. And you have the Page of Cups in reverse here. I feel like both of you guys, what you don't see coming, is that you're not listening to your intuition. Both of you guys are not listening to your intuition here. Yeah, this isn't going to work out. This isn't going to work out. I feel like what's between you guys is your wish. Like, your true wish fulfillment is not each other. And that is what's between you. Yep. You really could be dealing with a Sag. Because I think um, they had that kind of same energy too. Like the big elephant in the room. is kind of what I'm feeling here with you too. It's like you guys both don't really want this. Your wish is... It, it, the star is what's in the middle. That's your wish. Which means it's not you guys. So I would figure out what to do here. Because... There's the, the hermit mode is the hermit energy is here. So I feel like there's also could be distance space. You guys could be like not talking a lot. That's all for a reason, cancer, okay? All right, that's all that I have for you. I hope this helped. Have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this and stay positive.